Mitch, have you ever seen butterfly stone? I have seen that. You know, uh, have you guys seen it? It's it's where you basically have a dividing line and you have a mirrored look. You know, where they'll actually, when they're slabbing a stone, okay, they you, you know how they slab a stone with the rope? Yes, it's the diamond diamond rope. diamond rope. Okay, so they actually go through and they cut it like a loaf of bread. They're basically stacked on top of each other. Yep. And if you're building a high-end like hotel or you got a big wall backdrop. Shower like that. Okay, perfect. Yeah. A big wall shower yep. panel. They'll butterfly it where it's bookmarked is, is how they call it. And they'll open up those slabs and they'll mirror one another because they do that with yeah, it. That's cool. Right? It's really cool. Very expensive. Yeah, because you're using just this, you know, that two sections. So you're buying two slabs. Yes. And really, you could have used one if you stood it up Ex that way. Exactly. Yeah. So what do you think? Do you want to watch us butterfly this stone? Stay tuned. Enjoy the video. And I guess if their answer is no, don't enjoy the video. We'll see you next time. But stay. And like, subscribe. Ring the bell to get notified. Every time we have a new video. Thanks again. <laughs> yes. You got it. Art Coat is designed as the most UV resistant epoxy resin designed for countertops, man. Definitely. It's important to be heat resistant and scratch resistant. It's important to be non-yellowing. Yep. It's important to be able to withstand the use and abuse of kitchens, bathrooms, Definitely. hot stuff, cold stuff, thermal shock, man. Right. You know, you could actually take a hot pan that you've boiled water in or a cookie sheet out of the oven at 425 and set it on the countertop. I've done it, it works. All right, you all mixed? You all mixed. We're using white metallic, black metallic, diamond dust, white and black spray paint, white and black dye. By mixing and matching your blacks and your whites, you can create any shade of gray, even 50 shades of gray. Give me another cup, bro. Clear cup? Yeah, I'm just gonna make a bunch of different shades of stuff. Just add a little metallic in this. Go ahead and kind of undermix that. Add some diamond dust to this white. Add a little diamond dust to that. And just kind of undermix. And then one of these I'm gonna make like a exotic pork cup. Ooh, make a little vein in there. Yeah. Here we go. Pretty centered. Fatter in the middle. And skinny. Go ahead, Mitch, do, do a color. Okay, everyone, it is time for the question of the day. In just a few moments, we're gonna see how Mike and Mitch add a seam to this epoxy project. Now, what I wanna know is how would you make your epoxy project symmetrical on both sides like we see in real life? I know there's more than one way to do this, so I'm curious how you would go about it. So let me know in the comments below. <laughs> I like the, I didn't think I'd like as much black, but that's giving it some pop, man. Mm -hmm. So are these little uh, exotic veins you're, we're putting in. Yeah. It's neat. I mean, you could do this in a whole kitchen relatively easily. This is very repeatable. I'm gonna rub the front edge. Is that cool? Yep.
I have an idea for your seam. I think we should take a, a string and snap a string in the middle. Cool piece. <laughs> oh, yeah. Tell me when. I think I'm good. I'm gonna pull real tight. Now I'm just gonna wiggle it a little. Hold it, and then pull up. Yeah, one guy pulling up. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I didn't good job. Go left or right. That's better, look. See, yeah. you put that in. That looks way better. <laughs> that looks sick. That looks like a seam, dude. Mm-hmm. It cut right into the epoxy. That was really neat. Wow. Wow. Guys, I hope you liked this video. Did you like this piece? I liked making it with you, man. That was a lot of fun. The wire was a great unlock. It looks like a bookmarked slab. We got a surprise for them. They should go check out this little piece, right? Yes. Guys, have you seen the little piece that we did? We're going to link that at the end of this video. Guys, until next time from Stone Coat Countertops, you got this. We'll see you on the next video. On the next one. <laughs>